I learned to type on this typewriter drink that you would go like this right so my experience with computers was taking attendance you know uh, lesson plans when they started talking about Google Classroom I'm going like, mm, what is that Truman Elementary teacher Esperanza Salinas started her 49th year of teaching this week she tells us she never thought she'd experience a pandemic, and because of her age, she didn't want to be the weak link on her campus. I did take a lot of Google Classroom one-hour sessions, and it's like I tell my, my, my team, in Innovate, I did 20 hours. In Pre-Innovate, I did probably another 10 hours, right? I said, can I sit down at the computer and implement everything I learned? No, but at least I learned what each program can do. Salinas says she's excited with all that Google Classroom can provide. I will never go back to not using Google Classroom because even when the kids are in front of me, with God's will, we will eventually get there. It is an amazing resource. The longtime teacher tells us she's thankful for the support from her principal and her peers. Have I become a different teacher? Definitely. Have I learned a lot this summer? Absolutely. And my goal is how long I'm going to continue in this classroom, only God knows, and my knees. But um, I will not take a step back. The experienced educator is full of energy and she explained that she's a firm believer that God puts people in your path. A path that at 71 years old, she's thankful continues with the CISD. Reporting for Edinburgh CISD, your district of choice, I'm Delia Ramirez. And I leave you with these words of wisdom for the 2020-2021 school year from Esperanza Salinas. This is a very hard job to do because of the importance of the job. We are, we as teachers are working with the citizens of tomorrow. They are, they are citizens in training, okay? We spend some, during the school year, we spend more waking hours with our students than they do with their parents, right? So, if it's not your passion, if walking into this classroom and sitting in front of these children is not your passion, you need to find your passion. You need to find it because it shows. It, it shows to the kids. And this is my passion. After my children and my grandchildren, this is my passion.